Hey there, welcome to my channel. My name is Marcella, and as you can see, I am in this intro all by myself. I'm not with Valorin, who you guys will see in just a couple of seconds, my sister-in-law, but I realized when I was editing this video that I totally forgot to film an intro with Val on this video. So before we go ahead and get to the video, I would love it so, so much if you went ahead and considered subscribing to my YouTube channel. And let me know if you like this type of content where I'm collaborating with another Avon representative. I honestly found it super fun. And I told Val, next time I'm in Georgia, let's do it again, you know? And if I so happen to be, and honestly, it's probably not going to happen anytime soon, but if I so happen to be around another Avon rep, I would love to do something similar. Maybe we can even do it virtually, like on a webcam or something. So yeah, let me know if this is something that you guys enjoy collaborating with other Avon representatives, okay? But now let's go ahead and see what our favorite Avon makeup products are. Guys, I'm so obsessed with this primer. Like I'm almost <laughs> running out. This is the Tone Up Primer in Luminaire. So I picked this one up just because the fact that I figured, you know, it has a little bit of shimmer in there, but it's not like super in your face, but it really helps with giving you a such a pretty glow. So I put this on, even if I'm just like wearing concealer, I'll put it on as a primer, put on some concealer, or if I'm just wearing a full face of makeup, I'll put this on underneath and it helps with giving me such a pretty, pretty glow. It, really does. it lasts all day. So it doesn't make me, you know, oily or cake or anything. So it's such a nice face. This is my number one product from Avon. Okay, so mine is definitely the Believe Plus VDL, and this is the yes. setting spray. And even though I do like to use the VDL Lumi Layer Primer by mm -hmm. itself when it's like on the go, yeah. I will like miss this on my face right before I even put my makeup and then oh. after. And I do yes. think that when it like sprays, uh -huh. it has like a really like nice spray, first of all. Yeah. Like it has like a really good thing, and it smells really good. It smells so refreshing, and I just feel like it does really help my makeup stay on for longer, especially yes. my foundation. See, so I have that at home too, but because I flew and I just did a carry on, it's I, so big. I didn't bring it with yeah. me, but it's definitely one of them. I think I actually put that in my top I 10 think so. Avon. I products. definitely want to try that primer because, yeah, sure. yeah I love the Lumi Layer one. It's so, so awesome. Good. So good. So, yeah, for next for me, I mean, I. I just cannot, I cannot I not include this in a favorites, but it's the Avon Magic Swand. And this is a foundation stick. And it's so funny, when this first came out, I honestly wasn't really attracted to it. Like I didn't really pick it up when I first came out. But then for some reason, I think I was like at an Avon event and they were giving us yes. like some goodie bags and they, they put this they in, there. in there. I tried it, I was like, oh my it's God. Really it just, it glides on the skin. It blends in so, so well. And my favorite thing is it does not leave you mad. Matt. Lately, I haven't been liking really a matte look. I like more of like a like a glowy look, mm -hmm. and this really gives it to you, and it looks super duper natural. So this is my favorite foundation, and I have the shade Coconut. So that's like my winter shade. It's what I have on right now, and what I love is it's super inexpensive, and it'll last you quite a bit. So I'll show you guys kind of what it looks like, but it's just a stick foundation. So this is definitely my favorite Avon foundation. This is the actual The Magic Scented Moisturizer, right. and... So yeah, this is the Magic Swan. So yeah. There's like a whole little collection within Avon, the Magic's collection. And to so be she honest likes you, the, I love these. So yeah, she likes the tint. I love these, like, like the collection that mm -hmm. fell on these Magics, just mm -hmm. because I feel like it does give you that natural glow. Yeah. And you're, it has like such a good tint that it even blocks away all like the redness. Ooh, like yeah. I really love that, especially because I have a lot of redness around like my mouth, mm. and I just feel like it does the job and it lasts really long and it does like again give you that nice like glowy, hydrated kind of look and it doesn't yes. make you all like matte and right. like dry. That's so funny. I definitely my, love that. My cousin also, so she stayed with us over the summer it's and a she a like she loves that stuff too because it's lightweight, like you said, beautiful coverage and it looks super duper yes. natural. So that's a really good pick too. Oh yeah, and that's the color light. Yeah. Yes. I actually, did you see, so we, Tell me. we um, a couple weeks ago, Avon had like their leadership kickoff. <laughs> so they showed us in the next six months <sighs> what's coming. Yes. <laughs> for Avon and guys they are expanding oh, that line. this line a ton so yes. I'm really excited they saw I think they said they're gonna have like a matte line and then they're gonna have oh I can't remember the other line but expect this line to grow and I'm super excited I'm so to try excited. yeah because I love all of that even like the magic dust mm -hmm. I, I like love that, that line love it so so much okay so we're sticking again with the face and for me it's the Avon long wear concealer it's for ca from the cashmere complexion line That's this came out last year and it has taken over as my favorite concealer as i mentioned before i feel like avon didn't really have a great concealer at least in my opinion no, under the eyes yeah, yeah. and true. so once they came out with this collection 
I was so excited because this concealer just looked amazing and it sure is. It blends beautifully, not only under the eyes, but any anywhere else you wanna highlight on your face. And so it comes in quite a bit of colors. It's a really great price. It's gonna last you quite a bit. And like I said, my favorite thing is that it blends in mm -hmm. so nicely and does not leave you with any creases. So it looks so natural. It looks so natural. Yeah. And Even though it brings that highlight to your face. Right, and like my thing that I love too is sometimes I'll just wear this on my own. Like if I don't want any foundation, I'll just put on some concealer and it looks great. So again with the face, and yeah. this is the color of loves and this is the actual highlighter. Ooh. or highlight yeah i love this one this is in the color golden lily it's so pretty and even sometimes i will use it like a blush kind of thing and i just love it again because it leaves my skin looking glowy mm -hmm. and it just doesn't look dry and my yeah. skin is like on the oily kind of dry side so i definitely love how it makes my face look hydrated yeah. and yeah i like that there's kind of like a little pink yes. tint to it yeah so it, and ca it can kind of go for like a blush exactly. and a highlight at the same time i, I think it. i have that one I and it does give me like a natural highlight yeah, too right i love so that pretty Alrighty. so next here this is a new product for us and i know you have it too. okay i do have it. I have she has color. a different shade. So I have here the shade so Riding Hood, and this is a VDL Creamy Stick Jelly. This is a new product for us, and this is kind of a multi-use mm -hmm. stick. So it can be used for the lips and the cheeks. I'm actually really tempted to try it on the eyes and I see kind of what it looks on the eyes, but one. I currently have this on the cheeks and as you guys can see it's not leaving me a really bright red color but it's more so like a natural i would say and like a natural kind of yes. color natural kind of flush so i love it because the the consistency too right like it just yeah, it's feels, not like sticky it's or not anything sticky. i don't know if you can see that but it's color. just it's so this natural. is really light yeah this is like more like a mauvey color mm -hmm. but i do like how it's really natural as well yeah. and it still gives you that like rosy kind of right. like sun-kissed look it's just i really like it so, and it's so not pretty. sticky it's right. so easy to like blend into like the skin it just looks very natural right. it's really smooth yeah. this is one of really my like favorite one of <laughs> that's of our favorites yeah definitely <laughs> this is the color rose flake and i definitely yeah. love this one and yeah. um, by the way i know i have a well on a lot of these videos actually i've yeah. done like more in-depth a little bit more. reviews about them and swatches so i'll make sure to leave mine down below and if then if val has any i'll link those down below Perfect. as well so then my very last favorite is actually our glimmer stick lip liner in oh. simply spice so That's the best i know she has this one too she's actually the person that put me on it because it's just such, and i actually have it swatched right, oh, yeah, right here now. it's such a pretty mauvey color and i have it all over my lips as well so what i'll do with this is i'll just line my lips and i'll kind of fill it in a little bit more and then put a clear gloss on top and it looks really pretty natural and it's i just think yeah, it's a really so natural. pretty natural or neutral lip color so i do that sometimes like i'll just take a lip liner and kind of use it as a lipstick and fill in my lips yeah. completely so that's number five for me and number five for me is the highbrow gel and i am I'm pretty much like obsessed with this in mm -hmm. the beginning i didn't know how to use it because it's Same really way. pigmented mm -hmm. so i would put it on and it would like leave like really like hard streaks on my eyebrows okay. but once i learned how to use it uh -huh. it is amazing i feel Ooh. like it really like fills in my eyebrows like they're not I don't have a lot of eyebrows, but they just look very nice and like fluffy and like that whole like natural eyebrow that everybody's yeah. going for. Definitely number five for me is my highbrow gel. See, I'm gonna have to watch you how yeah, you try put it, it on because I also have this product and I feel like as well, like it's I've never tried to use it alone. I've just used it, like I've, I've you know, filled in mm -hmm. my brows and then used it and I feel like it looks like too much, but it like does. you said, yeah. it's tinted. So I should just try to use it on its own to give it more like a and natural brow look. And when I just like, use like a clean brush mm -hmm. after it and like go back onto it, I just Ooh. feel like it helps because yeah. it does have a lot of like product in there, but See, I like it. Exactly, we, we love other. this. Uh, <laughs> I love this. Alrighty guys, well that was our top 10 products. Again, I will leave them linked down below. I will link my five products to my store and Val's five products Perfect. to her store and then again check out val's channel she has a ton of videos and again it goes beyond avon she talks about motherhood she shows my adorable niece and nephew yes. which i love so so much so if you want to shop any of these products and you've never shopped with avon before i'm gonna leave a link down below that will take you to a little form you can fill out where you can go ahead and request some coupon codes for me and i will go ahead and send those over to you okay so do that click that and i will send you over a coupon code so you can save some money on your avon product 
But yeah, guys, that is it for us today. I hope you enjoyed this little video. And thanks if you, for having me. Yeah, of course. Anytime. I mean, every time I'm in Georgia, yeah, it's now, so fun. I feel no, like we're gonna like record this. a video because might as well. It keeps yeah. it fun, keeps it interesting, and you get to hear two different people talk about Avon, right? That's true. But yeah, guys, thanks again for watching, and we will see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.